Today I'm going to be talking about um, uh, giving ideas of promotions and contents that can be done for Super Bowl parties, right, for your restaurant or, or bar in the year of 2020. So Super Bowl is approaching pretty soon here. Uh, when, by the time I'm recording this, it's uh, maybe, you know, a couple of weeks away. And I figure I share something like this, if this is something you've been looking for, or if you already have um, great events, I'm going to also be talking about what are some ways that you can uh, promote your event uh, to in increase the local reach even more, right? To make sure that more local customers can see it. All right, before I get started, my name is Leo. I guess if you don't know me, right? I, I help uh, local customers or le local businesses here in the area to increase the online visibility so that more um, local customers can find them. So the first one I, I want to share with you, I found in Groupon, right, and it's basically uh, providing giveaways. Um, there's appetizers um, that are mentioned over here or offers um, that can be given away. So make sure that um, there's things that you can try, right? These are things I haven't even tried. This is just idea that I Google, um, that I found on Google, different companies did. Uh, but it's something that uh, just to give ideas, right? You, you should uh, you should be open to test if you have the, the, the capital to do it. And if you're just looking to find, get ideas. Um, so think about that, right? Uh, what offers or what items, uh, free advertising can be given. Um, other stuff over here is that you can give stuff away. Uh, something that mentions over here is pro probably doing cross-promotional uh, with other businesses, right? Like giving away gift baskets or... Um, items like for example this um, article that I saw over here is from a person that I follow that owns uh, three I believe bars restaurants and it, he says he always does a TV giveaway so um, imagine that right giving a, doing a TV giveaway um, this other person over here or this other um, bar owner or restaurant owner that he interviews uh, gives away free drinks during the game to the ladies. Imagine that, right? That's You probably be thinking like, well, that's crazy, right? And they do some things, right, to make sure that there's not a lot of uh, cheating going on. Uh, and, but even at the end of the day, he still makes 8,000 to 9,000 more in sales by giving away free drinks. And obviously, like I said, again, right, this is things you got to try, test yourself. You got to know your numbers. You got to see to see if, uh, if something like this is something you can afford to try. If you try it, did it work, right? How many, how much more sales you did? Was it profitable or not? Um, so test it out. Obviously, ladies doesn't come um, uh, on her own most of the time, right? And most of the time, they're accompanied by uh, males. So test it out. Now, obviously, these are all great ideas. Perhaps you have your own great idea. If you want to share it, please do so in the comments. Uh, but now, how can we make our local community more aware, right, of what we got going on? Some things you can do is, for example, use Google My Business. If you have your business listed, um, your business added to Google, it's free to do, you can go manage it and you can do posts, right? One of the things you can do is add events. And when people are searching for your business or local or businesses similar to yours, uh, they can see things like this on their profile, right? So, for example, if I go to search for a card. I've got a call Mexican restaurant. Um, you can see that people are scrolling down and they may they see pictures, right, and stuff. If there was an event, it will come up over here. So this was not a good example, but you get an idea. So add those in there. Uh, other things you can do, obviously, is get your page, your business page on Facebook and add events, right? It's, it's free to create a business page. It's free to create events. And then you can either pay some money to share, to advertise it, uh, or, or share it on local posts on your community, on local groups on your community. Uh, other things you can do is go to local chambers. This one, for example, is the Solana Hispanic Chamber of Commerce, which I'm a board member of. And, and with us, we allowed uh, anybody in the business, either the members or no or not, to come on our website and submit an uh, event to see if we're going to allow it or not. So just make sure that uh, if you complete all this information, submit it, and then uh, wait for approval. Most local chambers in around, around they, do, they do have a system that allows you to do that. 
Um, but I suggest you obviously to contact your local chamber to see if they have a system of the capacity to allow any business to um, uh, list their event on their website. So those are different ways how you can list your event for free. Obviously, you can go to other websites like Eventbrite. If you don't know, right? Eventbrite is free to list your event. And um, <clears throat> um, uh, you can go ahead and test it out. Um, now, something else you can do, I would recommend, is to put some money behind those great events and giveaways. Uh, this one um, is something that we were giving away for El Caracol Mexican Restaurant, one of my customers. We were giving away a free dinner for two. And things like this, this just go crazy, right? All we did is just uh, show in front of a lot of people in our area or show it in front of people in our area. Maybe we put $10, $15 behind it. But just look at the numbers, right? There's 10,332 people in our area that this was reached without paying a lot of money. That's the crazy part about it. Um, there's about 2,000 people that were engaging with it. You know, that would be from liking it, commenting, sharing it, uh, looking at the pictures closer, going to a website, etc. That's an engagement. Uh, and you can see here the numbers, right? 125 interactions from liking and hearts and 176 comments and 60 shares. Um, it, it just goes viral pretty much. So um, it just raises a little awareness. Now out of this, right, if you set it up right, um, you can do other things like capture information. So we capture information so that we can continue to send uh, promotions like, you know, Super Bowl giveaways, free dinners for two, and people just basically go uh, nuts over them. Uh, so that's all for today. If you like the information, please go ahead and subscribe. Right? If you like more videos like this, subscribe to my channel. Uh, follow us on Facebook or Instagram, depending where you're watching this. Uh, if you have questions or other ideas or other things you'd like to see related to digital marketing, 